hello guys welcome back to my channel so guys today we are going to learn here how to create DNS record so this is my DNS or you can say this is my AD server and I have opened here server manager console this is server manager and I'm going to show you how you can create DNS record but before go ahead I want to request you if you are a new user for my channel request you to please subscribe for new upcoming videos and just click on bell icon so that you can get notification as well so now I'm going to op open here DNS manager and you can see here there are two zone that is for lookup zone and second one is reverse lookup zone and I hope you have an idea about these zones for our lookup and reverse lookup zone if you have any confusion just leave your comment I will reply so now we are going to create DNS record host record or any other record like CNAME, alias name or MX record so just I have expanded here for lookup zone and here you can see domain name in this way you will you will be able to see the domain name of or your domain name so just right click here means on domain name you can see here the option is new host record new alias name or c name new mail exchange so if you have to create alias name or cname just you need to click here and enter the required details or if you want to create new host record just you need to create here a new host record and I hope you have an idea also why we need to create new host record if you have not idea just leave your comment also for now I am going to create here the record so suppose here if you have a machine or if you have a server or client machine for that you need to create a record and that machine name is like test PC test PC and that machine IP and test PC machine IP is like 10.10.10.15 and here there are two options like create associated pointer record allow any authentic authenticated user to update DNS record with the same owner name so if you select this option like create associated pointer record then in reverse lookup zone there will be uh, uh, a record create there will be a record that will be created in reverse lookup zone so I will show you after creating this now I am just going to select add host you can see the host record test pc.idpriva.line was successfully created just click on ok done so you can see here the option that is test pc host a record is created now and if you will if you will check and reverse lookup zone you can see the reverse lookup zone uh, means a pointer record is created in a reverse lookup zone you can see the IP is 10.10.15 and that machine hostname is test.itpriva.lan but if you don't want to create pointer record so 
just you need to uncheck this option like I am going to create here one more record but will not create here pointer record just for testing purpose or just I want to show you like if you machine name is max pc and that ip is 10.10.10.3 or any other and just uncheck this option click on add host button ok done so here in for lookup zone host a record is created but if you will check in reverse lookup zone you will not find any record because we have unchecked that option that is to create associated point record so the conclusion is this if you don't want to create pointer record just uncheck that option or if you want to create pointer record as well then just check that option that is update associated pointer record this one so guys I hope now it is clear to you how to create host a record or cname alias name for alias name just you need to select this you need to ne enter here alias name and that server name here that you can browse here or just if you have the server name you can enter here and click ok so in this way you can create DNS records so I hope this video will be he will be helpful for you. So guys, again I re I request you to please subscribe my channel and click on bell icon and if possible please share with your friends. Thanks. Bye bye.